Welcome to the Friars Chapel of St. Francis. We're very happy to have you and have you in our chapel here where we pray and have liturgy every day. I would like just to share with you a few words about the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary. In the Gospel of the Mass for the Assumption, we hear the account of the visitation of Mary to her cousin Elizabeth. This significant meeting of the two girls is not only between two pregnant women, but also the meeting of the precursor John the Baptist and the promised Savior, Jesus Christ, which culminates in Mary's great prayer called the Magnificat. This was her statement of praise and gave her with the gift of being the mother of God. Her assumption into heaven was the combination of her earthly life and the beginning of her eternal life. It was the result of her exemplary life of faith, hope, and love, made of grace by virtue of her bearing Jesus and living a life of perfect obedience and discipleship. Her entry into heaven, body and soul, provides hope and inspiration for you and I. We may not be the person Mary was, but we have been graced, graced by virtue of our baptism and nourished by the sacraments. Mary was human like us. She was subject to a lot of temptations and challenges in trying to live life faithfully to God. She endured and was successful. Her faith prevailed over her own wants and her love of God triumphed over her weakness. Her hope was strong against the threshold and the dangers of life. Mary was a woman to behold. She knew salvation history, but more importantly, she knew her God. As we prepare to celebrate the Feast of the Assumption, let each one of us reflect on how God acts in our lives like he did for Mary. Hopefully, we will see and recognize his faithfulness to us the promises to us. And when we are also faithful, we will also have our own assumption into heaven with Mary. Have a blessed feast and always remember you are in our prayers.